Hello everyone, my name is Kat and welcome back to my channel. Um, we are going to continue our playthrough of Red Dead Redemption 2. Um, last I remember we were hunting down old outlaw bandit guys for the that one guy that was in the bar. So, we'll go and see if we can find the other ones or maybe we'll go on a different quest. I don't know, we'll find out, right? Um, I also found out that that guy that I was kind of mean to in the town, the uh, guy with the missing arm, apparently he's not going to rob you. So I feel bad about that. I don't know if we can be friends with him or not. Looks like we're still in this place. So let's see. Where are we? We are in Blue Water Marsh. What's that? Who's that? Is that a town? Oh, that's a town. Okay. Um, okay. Who is this? Javier. Let's look at... Oh. Oh! There is something! That's cool. Okay, I was wondering if you could see, like, you know, how they were doing. How's Arthur doing? He's average weight, temperature's fair, honor neutral, I think. Good deeds will improve your honor level. Yeah. That's a tree. Horses. Dangerous foreigner. Do I help her? Where's the lock? Of course. Let's get our fist back out. Come on, get on your horse. Where's your horse? Go faster, horsey. Go, 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 go. Maybe I should have chose a faster horse. Go, Mr. Horse, go. Why would you do that? I don't want to kill this guy. What does that 21 mean? Oh no! I was just helping.
I was just helping, I swear. Now, come on. Fucking Christ. I just won't go back over there. Easy. Right? There's no way these people talk. Wanted. You are now wanted, law men are now searching for you. Fuck. How do I get rid of it? Evade the law by escaping from... Oh. Just go into the woods here. I'm sorry, Mr. Horse. I assume when the red wanted is done, we're good. What? Oh, is that a gator? The law is no longer pursuing you, but your crimes won't be forgotten. If you are spotted by a lawman in a red area, then you may become wanted again. Can you eat gator? I hate that I keep doing that. Oh god, lawmen have posted a bounty in your head. Avoid them or pay off your bounty at a post office. 20 bucks? Oh my god. Oh my god, this is the worst part of this game. Holy shit. Okay. Corresponding. Oh, oh. Hey, what? I got away, but they got my wife. Please, mister. I gotta do something. All right. Where is she? It's a sack out in the swamp by the water. <laughs> Okay. Go on. See if you can find the law. I'll do what I can. Let's go save this lady. What do you say? Oh, I thought that was her. No problem. I just hope the law don't come. And I hope it's fine that I just dropped him outside your front door. Is that it? Okay, I don't think that's it. I think she still needs something. There's some money I put away in the sack there. It ain't enough, but please take it. 
Oh, you don't have to do that. Of course. Appreciate it. Good luck to you. Does the do they just give up on like the bounty thing? Why is there just a wagon there? Hold on there. A minute of your time. Let's get us a closer look at this one here. Round here. Stranger's got a cough up payment. Get down from there. You hear? Despite what you seem to think. Ah! Let's, uh. Easy peasy. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy. Oh, let's inspect the document. Oh, okay, that's how we do it. Cover sent. I didn't know if there were more. Is that, are those, what, who are they? Is that the KKK? Well, now what? What happened? I lost money? What the fuck? Damn it. Okay, well, now what? What was that? Is that a snake? Did I just run over a snake? Can I load? What am I doing? Story? Oh yeah, I'm not doing that. That's way back. No. Just count my losses, I guess. What is that, milk? I don't want to go behind the guy or buy the guy. Yeah. 
What are those horses? What's that? Oh no. Twisted my ankle something fierce. Think you could give me a ride? Yeah, sure. Hop on. Oh, thank you, sir. Thank you. Sure. Glad I ran into you. Okay, huh. where are we going? I raised that horse, you know. Raised it since mm -hmm. it was just a foal. Oh, mm -hmm. losing a horse is hard. Sorry to hear that. Yeah, that horse did right by me. Better than my husband, mm -hmm. truth be told. That fool. Always complaining, but does he do something about it? I assume not. Man barely lifts his hand to wave the flies away, aside from to lift a drink, of course. Marriage for me has been nothing but trouble. But Biscuit, he was a fine animal. Loyal, smart, brave. Mm -hmm. Didn't take no guff, not from no one. Had one of them mountain boys pull a gun on me once. I was riding up near the Dakota and had stopped by a nice warm patch. Must have dozed off, but I wake up and find some nasty piece of work pointing a rusty shotgun straight at me. Well, he gets wheezing on and I must have made some sort of noise because the next thing I know, Biscuit had nipped his ear clean off. Kicked his hide too as he was hollering away. Mm -hmm. Didn't think a man could run so fast. That's funny. Oh yeah? Yeah. Had a good laugh on that one. <laughs> I tell the husband, what does he do? Should have never gone over there, honey, he says. Gee, thanks. <coughs> so, you live at Emerald Ranch then? For the time being. I was looking for work. They was looking for some help with the gardens. If I waited any longer for I'll my husband that. put food on the table, I'd have died of starvation. I'll be moving on soon, though. Emerald Ranch, well, it's a strange place. How so? The owner's a mean bastard. Horses. Strange, too. The lights in bullying folk. I like that one. There's a the daughter, but she the, never leaves the, the house. Body. That's pretty. You can see her in the window sometimes. I'm to keep the big guy here. When I asked about her, everybody told me to leave it alone. Found an old saloon there. All shut down now. But I went in to have a look, and there's bullet holes, old blood stains. Something definitely happened there, but I couldn't figure it. Just an uncomfortable feeling to the place. Either way, it's time I left. Especially now I lost that poor That's horse. That's kind of weird. I'll collect my belongings kinda and spooky. be on my way. Back home? I guess. I bet my husband's right where I left him. Bottle in hand. Oh, we're getting close now. I don't know where she wants me to stop. Right here? Here we go. This okay. is great. This was kind of you, mister. Please no take this as my way of thanking you. Oh, you didn't have to do that. Appreciate it. Oh, she gave me a ring. What hey, a we're kind of, we're still day. neutral, but we're getting butter. That's good. Okay, I need to find a post office. Where's the post office? Uh, saloon, no, no, gunsmith. Oh, you can cut your hair, I guess. That's cool. Butcher, that's the stables over there. What about over here? Post office, perfect. I'm going to go pay my bounty off. Okay, so how do we do this? Where do, are you? Are you on the other side? I don't know where you are. Let's go over here. And I don't know if the bounty's just in, I assume it's just in that specific area. Okay, no problem. Um, pay bounty. Liberty is worth every penny. Let's see, yes, that one, $20. That's not bad. Easy peasy, lemon Thanks squeezy. Alright, now we got that done. Let's go back to camp and see what we can do there. Okay, so I got all this stuff that I want to donate. Where do I go to donate it? Because I know that they complain about that. Provisions. Okay, okay. Wagon is well stacked. Stocked. Stacked. Jesus. Uh, okay, so let's go over there and hopefully we can donate the rest of our stuff. So we can't run in camp, which is annoying, but we can do a fast walk. 
Okay, over here. Where is it? Aha, found it. Okay. Uh, just, I guess, Everyone donate all of that? I don't know how much that's going to help. Just make sure it goes I'll just get rid of it all because I don't necessarily need it. I got, like, apples and stuff. And it's not necessarily difficult to get the animals, so. Easy peasy. Wait to taste this. Okay, so I guess I'll just donate all of it. Why not? Does that help? With, okay, so the meat turned white, which is good. Valuables. Okay. So let's go see what this carrion guy does. Because I don't know what else to do. Is that the only place that you can donate stuff is there? I assume that's it, right? Because what is this? This is the medical box. So I... Oh. Mr. Morgan. Yes, Miss Grimshaw. Mr. Matthews gave me a message for you. He said when it was convenient to head into Emerald Ranch. He's looking at a few mm -hmm. business things there. Okay. Oh, he'll find something too. He always does. Will you be well now, Mr. Morgan? I'm always well, Miss Grimshaw. Don't talk to me, Arthur. Oh, okay. Sorry. Okay, let's do it this guy. Come on, you brought me in. Help you got me. some speaking to do of your own. Not that old gang of yours. I said, I told you, I don't know nothing. Mm -hmm. That's what I thought. Whoa, I don't believe hold that. your horses there. It seems the uh, cat has got our friend here's tongue. I was thinking Mr. Williamson could have a word. You ready to talk, boy? I told you, mister. I told all of you. I don't know nothing, okay? They ain't no friends of mine. I just been ridden with them for a Horse while. Horseshit! You see, we heard that part, so how about you tell the truth? That's what you want me to do. Hurt him, so the mm -hmm. next time he opens his mouth, it is to tell us what is going on! Ah, who am I kidding? One of Driscoll's boys couldn't open his mouth, but he'd tell a lie. Screw it. Let's just have some fun. Huh? Geld him. Oh, yeah! What's he doing? Where's he going? Oh, don't worry. You're only balls, boy. Just gonna cause you trouble. Mm -hmm. You know, in Imperial Rome, mm -hmm. Unix was among the happiest What are you gonna do? Don't do that. No, you kidding me, right? Of course. You sick oh, bastard! So, what do you want from me? Well, you are gonna talk. The only question is now or okay. after we got these little fellas off. Okay, okay, listen. I know where old Driscoll was holed up. And you're right. He don't like you any more than you like him. He's at Six Point Cabin. Uh, I'll take you there. Serious, I don't like him. I mean, I like him even less than I like you. No offense. Oh, none taken. Okay then, partner. Uh, why don't you take a few of us up there right now? I got this, Dutch. Should be fun. All right, you. Come on. Let's oh, go. <laughs> Killed him. <laughs> Let's both hope you ain't trying to trick us, O'Driscoll. I ain't no O'Driscoll. Well, you sure as shit was. John, Bill, come here. We got a social call needs making. Where are we heading? Mm -hmm. Uh... We're up into the hills behind Valentine. Uh, well, I'll show you. John, you take Let's this go little get these guys. With you. Any nonsense, you kill them. Sure. You're gonna pay your buddies our respects. You taking us to Cole? That's what he says. Come on. I'm taking you to him. Look, I I'll give you more directions when we're close. But if I know where we are, it's up past Valentine. All right. I'll leave. Sharing saddle with an old Driscoll. Who'd have thought? How many times I gotta say? I ain't an old Driscoll. You sure look like one, and you smell like. God damn. You smell like one, too. I smell like horse shit. That's right. Boy, are you high. Morgan, you got throwing knives in your saddlebag. Dud said that you might. I was asked to give them. And I'm doing you the further courtesy of telling you about it. Next time you want to give me something, how about you give it to me instead of hiding it somewhere, hoping the opportunity comes up to mention it? Last goddamn favor I do you. 
Hey, hey, if, if I got my bearings, it's over here. Yeah, I know this country. Take this track up through the rocks. How are you holding up, Tom? Fine. Still ain't right, but I'm fine. You damn well should be after all that bed rest. Hey, all right. Abigail wouldn't let me up. You know her. She won't be reasoned with. Well, when you was having a failure of reason, hiding behind your woman, we were getting shot at. And I'd do the same for you, if you was in a bad way. I hope so. But I fear you don't know how to help anyone. Except in yourself. You see, O'Driscoll? If this is how he treats his friends, imagine what he does to his enemies. I got an inkling of what you all do to your enemies when you put those gelding tongs to my parts. Well, you still got those tongs? I got a knife. Won't be so clean, but it'll do the job. Keep that in your mind, young feller. Right at the forefront of it. I swear, I promise, I am taking you to comb as best as I can. You'll see, I'll make good. Now we go left, the uh, road will take us up and round. Boys, you know, you all ain't that different from the O'Driscolls. What did you just say? I've been watching you all these weeks, and, uh... You've been tied to a tree. You don't know nothing about this game. Yeah, well, I'd, I'd say you don't know much about the O'Driscolls. But maybe I know more about you than you know about them. And I know all about them, so... <laughs> Tell us then. How are we like those mongrel dogs? You're outlawed like them. You're out to survive like them. You live rough. You live hard. Fighting the law. Nature. You're out for yourselves. See? This is why you're an O'Driscoll, O'Driscoll. You're out to survive. We're out to live. Free. Colm's a sneak thief and a killer. Dutch is... Dutch is more like a teacher. From where I've been, you just look the same as all. Then you looked, but you ain't seen. John, shut that boy up. Enough out of you. Boys, we're almost on them. Now, who knows if this son of a bitch we got with us is talking true, but if it's what he says it is, and Colm O'Driscoll's here, we can end years of fighting. Here and now. Amen to that. Here, here. I hope we're almost I there. Swear, this is I feel bad for the up. horses. Okay, now, now cut left up here. We, we go down the hill into the forest. We're going in quiet. Taking them out as we find them. Trying not to set things off. But if we do, we move quick and hard. We settle this like we know how, okay? Okay by me. With you, Morgan. All right, then. Through the trees here. Let's go. You gonna get them knives. This guy I really wants me to get those knives, so I better make sure that I grab them. Where are they? Are they on my horse? No. Where are they? There they are. Found them. Okay. Perfect. Let me make sure that I actually grab them. There we go. Okay, I think we're good. Cabin's in the clearing down there. There'll be a bunch of fellers hiding out there too. Are these fellas armed? Armed? Drunk? Where are you strangers? Yup. And Colm O'Driscoll? Well, he'll be holed up in his cabin. Be passed out, booze blind, likely as not. Hey, over there. Someone's coming. So, uh, who's gonna tell him we ain't got nothing for the pot? Oh. Let me think. The fellow that spooked the game, I reckon. I'm gonna drain it. I I'll catch up. No, we ain't gonna fall for that. We're gonna wait so you can tell him yourself. Yeah, yeah, yeah. If anyone's actually gonna shoot the messenger, it'd be that mean son of a bitch. Mm -hmm, yes, sir. Come on, shake it off. We better be very what are we sneaky. Doing about the pisser, Morgan. 
Um, let's send Bill. Yeah, you got it. You got two over by the trees there, so. Why did he take care of this guy? Let's get close to okay. these two. Make no mistakes here. I'm gonna try and use these knives, but I don't think I'm gonna do it right. I'm gonna mess up somehow. I just know it. I just know it. I don't. He keeps getting closer, so I'm assuming that we're going, going in. I don't know. Um. We're waiting. Stealth kill. Bada boom, bada bing. Weapons expert. One of three knife kills. Nice. I'm doing well. I'm doing way too well. Oh, there's a guy there. Let's see if we can. Oh. Nope. Okay. Whoopsies. <laughs> I guess we'll um. We move quick. Start shooting. What are you hiding out in the woods for? Give up, old Driscoll's. We got you beat. We got him. Close him. I have a feeling this guy's not going to be in the cabin. Is that him? No. Oh. You alright? Sure. Thank you. <laughs> He's Come not there. Just... Surprises. Surprises. Here. You set us up. Come here! What? You set us up. No, I didn't. You I don't did. think he did. Oh, well, here. I think he here. genuinely I believed that he was there, and he was if not I there. Up, I, I wouldn't have <laughs> saved your life. It's a good point, That's very Arthur. true. All right, then, go on. Get out of here. Hey? I won't kill you. No, I didn't set you up. You're lost. Shit, lost. I'm letting you run away. Now, go on. Get out of here. That's as good as killing me. Out there? Without you? Como just was going to lose his mind about this. <laughs> so? So I'm one of you now. <sighs> Give me a break. All right then. But I'm Yay! Oh, hey, we I have know. a new friend. Well, let's get to camp. Wonderful. So cash, then? What cash? Cash. Yeah, some cash in the chimney. I'll check it. The rest of you boys, get to camp quick. See Arthur? I ain't so bad. <laughs> hey Bill. Yeah, he ain't so bad. You tell Dutch old Karen ain't worth killing just yet. <laughs> Right, you are. Okay, let's start searching. Money, money, money. Okay, money, 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 At least money. You got something tucked away. We got six hundred dollars. That's pretty good. Oh, and a gun. Okay, you guys. I think I'm gonna call it for this episode. I really appreciate you guys watching. And tune it in. Uh, let me know what you think. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye.